Hi, I'm Ray Vada, and I'm here with John Cozart at South by Southwest. John, how are you doing? I'm doing great. How are you? I'm good. So how are you enjoying South by Southwest? Uh, well, this is actually my first year coming uh, to South by Southwest, but it's amazing. And you live here in Austin, though, correct? So... Yes, I do. You know, I, I couldn't bring myself to go before just because I didn't know what it was. Okay. So and nobody know. had ever sold it to me. Has anyone explained it to you now? No. <laughs> I just walk into a place and then like Yahoo is on is on the, the title of the place and I walk in and then there's like they're serving beer. So it's like <laughs> Yahoo and beer. So that's good. That, that, that works outside. that works for you at this point. <laughs> that's about as much as I know about it. <laughs> so you are a, a big YouTuber. Is that a, is that a, a correct way to put it? You're a, you're a famous YouTuber. You're sure. A, well, a YouTube. I don't even know. I don't know the adjectives necessarily. Yeah. Um, I'm a YouTuber. I make YouTube videos professionally. Professional YouTuber. There How long have you been doing your videos for? This uh, I've been making videos since seventh grade. Okay. Um, so yeah, ever since like you could digitalize video, that's when I've been doing it. Okay. What what inspired you to start doing it in seventh grade? Um, Were you watching other YouTubers then, or sort of? I think I, I was watching maybe Charlie McDonald and What the Buck at okay. that point, which are they're old school, but they still make videos. They're great. Um, but I I was actually supposed to do assignments for my classes, like in my English class, I was supposed to write a paper, and instead of doing that, I would like go to my teacher and say, "Could I just make a video instead?" And she'd be like, "Sure." And so I just made videos and then and screened them for my class, and that was. What I did instead of making uh, papers, writing papers. papers. Have you been able to avoid writing papers basically your whole college, your whole career? It's Honestly, enough. middle school and high school. It doesn't uh, get work in college. No, it doesn't work in college. <laughs> no, unfortunately. But I am in film school, so that's when I stopped actually making videos and started writing papers. It's for film school. <laughs> it's for film school. Yeah, ironically. So you're you're <laughs> most well known on YouTube for the Disney parody mm -hmm. song. So how did that come as a Start as an idea for you, like where did that come from? I just I went to Mozart's, which is a copy place here in Austin, um, and I went there with my friend, and then I just said I need a new video. What, what? Are, and then I told her I wanted to sing Disney songs, and then we just kind of came up with the whole idea there. Yeah. Uh, me and my friend Marissa, and it was a it was a good chat, mm -hmm. and that was I mean I didn't realize it then, but that was pretty much what changed me from like you know, middle to lower tier YouTuber to a top tier YouTuber. Yeah, was it like a snap, like one to, like from that day? Honestly, it just honestly, changed? yeah. Well, once I released the video, it was like a week or two after that, it, it just blew up. Yeah. And my whole life was just, was just like about, uh, you know, staying in touch with people like, like agents and managers and like Los Angeles suddenly meant something to me <laughs> and it was very strange. But no, I had a blast those, those few weeks uh, when I started gaining credibility or whatever. You're still here now. Are you going to be Los Angeles? Is that your next move as a filmmaker, as a YouTuber? Is yeah. That... Well, I'm going to, okay, so yeah, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do the UTLA program, which at UT is like this program where they get you internships and give you okay. some classes in Los Angeles. And that's over the summer. And okay. then I'm going to go to Scotland, actually, for the Edinburgh uh, Fringe Festival. Oh, cool. And I'm going to do a live show there for a full month, but... Oh, okay. So, what has it? Is it the same format? Is it the kind of like performance or of like like YouTube live or for you, or is it completely different? Um, well, I've never done any like live show. I've done like yeah. a five or ten minute show during like YouTube conventions. But besides that, I, I haven't really done anything. But I'm trying to write original content for it and make it an entire one man show that I can really show off and and hopefully like it's a new career path. I don't know what I want to do exactly. <laughs> Is, is the honest truth. But you're kind of lucky. You don't have to really know because you have, you have this kind of outlet to try things out with, mm -hmm. right? So you can Yeah, kinda... it's like this great experiment yeah. that I still, I might never, you know, get a real answer. But yeah. right now it's just experiment. Do you feel pressure from people to, to do, because you do about, you know, one video, two videos a year. You don't do a weekly schedule mm -hmm. for your videos. Do you feel pressure from people? People come to you and say, like, do more on YouTube or are you? It's so weird. I, I don't know. I feel like if it's if the video is worth watching, then it better be good, you know. Yeah. And so I don't watch a lot of vloggers on YouTube. I don't watch a lot of people who just kind of throw things up and have them invest, uh, you invest in their lives. Yeah. Not that I'm like not interested in it. I just feel like, you know, if I'm going to live my life, I yeah. want to do it with my friends, and I can, you know, I just get a lot of fulfillment from that instead of watching people yeah. live their life. Um, and so that's why I could never do vlogging or anything like that because it's just not something I'm passionate about. But um, at the same time. Uh, I try to make videos that are original and that um, other people can't make necessarily. So it's something that's kind of new and worth sharing. Yeah. Um, that's my approach. But I do feel a lot of pressure because at the same time, 
Like I could spend months and months on a video and then it just doesn't do very well and I don't get a lot of views or traction from it. So um, I'm trying to balance it. I'm trying to figure out how to still you know, maintain relevancy in, within that whole spectrum. Do you have a new video coming up anytime soon? Is something in the works or what stage in the process are you in right now? Oh man, honestly I'm just terrified for this live show. And so I've just been like over preparing and trying to figure out what I'm gonna do. I just got this really cool looping software Okay. So you can loop your voice like live and do all these edited cool. And so I've been playing with that for the few past few days. And, yeah. Uh, that's what I've been doing. It's just as long as it's like a creative outlet, then I'll do it. Yeah. I never like think about YouTube differently than I would think about like doing an improv show on campus for a few yeah. people. I don't know. I approach every creative thing sort of with the same muster and energy. Makes sense. And then our question for everybody is, do you, is it, even though it's your first South by Southwest, mm -hmm. do you think that South by Southwest has jumped the shark? Oh, absolutely. It's done. <laughs> You're, you've come. It's over now. Yeah. That's the end. Honestly, honestly, uh, no idea. <laughs> but it's cool to me. I mean, yeah. I just don't, I don't know if I'm, I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> I suck. <laughs> All right. Thanks. Yeah. <laughs> you can cut that part at the end, Josh. <laughs> Part of the video. <laughs> there we pose and look cute. Oh no, I clapped again. We're gonna have to do it again. Oh yeah, I messed it up. I snapped, I think, at one point, and then I felt bad about that. <laughs> oh. Okay, now we're okay. <laughs> You can cut that part at the end, Josh. <laughs> That was the best part of the video. <laughs> there we pose and look cute. Oh no, I clapped again. We're gonna have to do it again. Oh yeah, I messed it up. I snapped, I think, at one point, and then I felt bad about that. <laughs> oh. Okay, now we're